Hello friends, I am Tulsi Ram Shinde and today we are going to discuss about the some different method to find state transition matrix. So let's start. Okay, find state transition matrix. Find state transition matrix. To find the state transition matrix, we have different method like the Laplace transform method, power series method, Kelly Hamilton theorem method and other methods are also, also available. So to understand how to find state transition matrix, I will take one example here. A state transition matrix, a system matrix A equal to 1101 and, and they ask find state transition matrix in this example input is absent so this is a simple example I will solve by using power series method then I will solve same example by using Laplace transform method and then we will discuss about the Kelly Hamilton theorem method so state transition matrix it is denoted by phi of t now we are solving by using power series method it is equal to e to the power a t and uh, in mathematics we learn different type of series for example series of 1 plus x to the power minus 1 Taylor series that time we learn series of exponential term and it is e to the power a x equal to 1 plus ax plus a square x square divided by 2 factorial plus a cube x cube divided by 3 factorial plus and so on. Same thing is here. Expand this term. First one, I will write identity matrix here. Plus a into x. That means a into t plus a square t square divided by 2 factorial plus a cube t cube divided by 3 factorial plus and so on and that so to find the state transition matrix we require a square and a cube system matrix A is given so I will find first a square a multiply by a you can use can see it is equal to 1 1 0 1 multiply by 1 1 0 1 it is equal to 1 into 1 1 plus 0 into 1 0 1 into 0 0 plus 0 into 1 0 1 into 1 equal to 1 plus 1 into 1 1 1 into 0 0 plus 1 into 1 1 that means a square equal to 1 2 0 1 right 2 0 1 right now a cube I can write a cube equal to a square into a. A square is given. 1, 2, 0, 1. And a equal to 1, 1, 0, 1. It is equal to 1 into 1, 1. Plus 0 into 1, 0. 1 into 0, 0. Plus 0 into 1, 0. 2 into 1, 2. 2 into 1, 2. Plus 1 into 1, 1. 2 into 0, 0. Plus 1 into 1, 1. That is equal to 1, 0, 3, 1. 1, 0, 3, 1. Now we have a square, a cube. I can write uh, e to the power at equal to i. I will 
will write i is equal to 1 0 0 1 plus a is given 1 1 0 1 multiply by t plus a square we find a square it is equal to 1 0 2 1 into t square divided by 2 factorial plus a cube a cube equal to 1 0 3 1 1 0 3 1 multiply by t cube divided by 3 factorial so simple, it is a simply addition now add all term 1 plus 1 into t plus t square by 2 factorial into 1 plus t cube by 3 factorial into 1 it will become 1 plus t plus t square divided by 2 factorial plus t cube divided by 3 factorial plus and so on right next term 0 0 0 0 that means it is 0 now here 0 plus 1 into t that means t 1 into t t plus 2 into t square by 2 factorial 2 to get cancelled t square right now t cube divided by 3 factorial into 3 3 3 get cancelled t cube divided by 2 factorial 2 t cube divided by 2 plus and so on ok now next term is similar 1 plus 1 into t plus 1 t square by 2 factorial plus 1 into t cube by 3 factorial that means 1 plus t plus t square by 2 factorial plus t cube by 3 factorial plus and so on now we know this whole term is the series of exponential term e to the power t this is 0 this is the series but uh, here we need to take t common t if you take t common then this is similar to this e to the power t now and this is equal to also e to the power t that means it is a state transition matrix ok now i will find state transition matrix by using laplace transform method and we know state transition matrix laplace transform method laplace transform method in this method we find state transition matrix e to the power a t equal to laplace inverse of yes identity matrix minus a inverse before going towards the solution i will explain this derivation in short we know what is the state transition matrix a matrix which satisfy linear homogeneous equation that means if we consider phi of t is a state transition matrix that means it will satisfy the linear homogeneous equation and that is x of t equal to phi of t x of 0 this is the initial state and this is the state after time t now we know state equation x dot equal to ax plus b u but this is a dynamic state equation now we are considering only homogeneous equation that means x dot equal to ax take the laplace transform laplace transform of x dot equal to s x of s minus x of 0 a is as it is laplace transform of x is x of s now take x of s common from both sides it will become s minus a x of s equal to x of 0 right now 
x of s equal to inverse of s minus a into x of 0 now I will take a inverse Laplace transform that means x of t equal to Laplace inverse of s identity matrix I will write it into a inverse x of 0 now compare this and this equation from equation 1 and 2 the term phi of t equal to Laplace inverse of s i minus a whole inverse so we take e to the power a t equal to Laplace inverse of s minus a whole inverse So now let's start the solution. First end s yes into i minus a. s yes into i minus a. It is equal to s yes, 0 0 s yes, minus 1 1 0 1. Okay. It is equal to s yes, minus 1 0 minus 0 0 minus 1 s yes, minus 1 right now find inverse s yes, into i minus a and the inverse is equal to adjoint divided by determinant adjoint is s yes, minus 1 0 1 s yes, minus 1 divided by determinant s yes, minus 1 multiplied by s yes, minus 1 1 multiply by s minus 1 minus 0 now divide each term by s minus 1 into s minus 1 it will get 1 divided by s minus 1 0 1 divided by s minus 1 whole square and 1 divided by s minus 1 right now find the Laplace inverse that means e to the power a t equal to Laplace inverse of s i minus a whole inverse is equal to Laplace inverse of 1 by s is equal to 1 and if s tends to s minus 1 it is multiplied by a to the power t it is equal to a to the power t Laplace inverse of 0 is 0 Laplace inverse of 1 by s is equal to t and if s tends to s minus 1 it will multiply by e to the power t t e to the power t and Laplace inverse of 1 upon s minus 1 is equal to e to the power t that means answer find by Laplace transform method is equal to answer find by power series method okay